Good day. I'm Peter Roney and I live in Blacksburg, Virginia. Today is Sunday, September 6, 2015. The title of this YouTube video is sort of a question. Did you notice? Well, you see three dots, and my intention here is to uh, complete this question in five different situations which I provide in this video. I give you the URL of a, an internet website, www.bugbookcomputermuseum.com. I first encountered by accident this uh, website in 2009 and I was bothered by it. So bothered that I created two uh, rebutful or whatever the word is, two rebutted uh, website www.blacksburg deception.com and bbookhistory.com two sites with 2020 hindsight that was a really good idea because I provided archival material on my lawsuit against Larson Titus 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 and also uh, provided downloadable PDF files of my original uh, typewritten bug books. And I also provided the uh, images of the six bug sets that I paid $50 for uh, in 1972. Okay, I think I've spent enough time on this slide so it will become the thumbnail. Well, many authors are listed by politician Larson on uh, this web story. I believe that uh, the 2009 version has been updated to 2014 or so. So uh, let me show you some uh, covers of these authors. Here they are, 15, 13, and seven more. I count a total of 35 outside authors that do not list politician Larson as co-authors. Well, I call all of these authors smart. Now, uh, the dumb uh, guys were the following. And who were the dumb guys? Well, three of the original four members of the Blacksburg group. Our names are myself, John Titus and Chris Titus. And we are the only authors who had the generosity to include uh, the politician as co-author when he contributed certainly to my six books, nothing to them. So here are examples, there are nine of them, of uh, the Howard W. Sands Blacksburg Continuing Education Series uh, typeset books. The only one that wasn't in the series is in the upper left-hand corner. It was one, it was one of 45,000 copies of Bug Book 3, and it was renamed the 8080A Bug Book. So, nine books, and even uh, then John and Chris published books without 
politician Larson uh, as co-author, and here they are. And as I look at these slides, I conclude that the dumb people were myself, Titus and Titus, and the smart authors were everybody else. Well, there was a settlement of my lawsuit against the so-called masterminds of Larson, Titus, and Titus, and it was signed on June 17, 1980. And I've realized these past few days that not uh, another book written after this settlement date was called The Bug Book. So this date is the death of the bug books. They had a, a lifetime of six years from August 74 to June 17, 1980, and that was the end. With a bit of sadness, I note that John Titus stopped designing microcomputer trainers after June 17, 1980, if not before, maybe 1979. He stopped. He had wonderful uh, microcomputer trainers, and he stopped. I've never asked him uh, why. Well, back to the politician. Uh, this is the URL of the offending uh, web story. And I believe it's been revised since 2009. And if you look at it today, you uh, see uh, the politician's taste for color covers. And here they are, screen captures on this page. Um, there was some text in this uh, bug book story, and I capture uh, a small group of paragraphs and focus on the very last sentence. Please note the above was as the group existed in 1984. Well, that was several years after the June 17, 1980 settlement. So what was the situation before 1980? Who knows? The politician doesn't say. And that's all, folks. I hope that you found my survey of uh, the Bug Book History article to be interesting. And good day.